Hey everybody, it's Country Mouse, and I'm here with a new unboxing to me. I would like to say I've never done this unboxing, but I've already recorded this once before and did not like the way it looked. So, I figured I'll spruce it up with some kitty cat ears that has some flowers, and we'll try it again. Another subscriber told me I should try out this box because they were interested in it, but they won my opinion before they got the box. And this box is, look fantastic. Now it's missing all the worms and everything else that's in the box like that. So I can't show you the actual packaging. It has already been taken out and it is gone. <laughs> So we're going to redo this with just what I have. I hope that's okay for you guys. And let's get into this. Look fantastic. It's $19.99 a month. It's basically, I believe, like an overseas type of subscription box. It's kind of like glossy box, but I, I'm not sure here. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm not sure here. <laughs> but we'll go ahead and go through this. I mean, if you have this box, maybe I just got a box that's not for me at the moment. Maybe next month's box will be even better. But this is a spoiler. All right. My first video had a lot of negativity. We will try to keep it upbeat with a big smile. Okay? <laughs> All right, inside the box on the lid looks like this light glossy box. It has beautiful boxes, good sturdy boxes. We're not here to buy the boxes. I'm not spending $19.99 on a box. But I want to know the products because I would like to find something other to take the place of my glossy box. And I'm thinking I already know what box is going to do that. But I will ask you guys later. All right, inside the box, because... I could not imagine why this box was as big as it is, but they stick an L magazine in there. I've never read an L magazine before. I'm a Cosmo girl, so this I'll have to look down, look at it later. Might take some, take my husband's tablet and his phone away and stick him in the bathroom with one of these. <laughs> not for dirty purposes, you dirty-minded people. Um, but I will give it a look through when I'm done. And they also give you a little booklet. Now this is pretty neat. I like the fact of this booklet. This booklet is nice. Mostly you get from other subscriptions just a little pamphlet and that's it. You basically look at that sheet and that's what you have. Alright. I know the information's in here because it says in here if you need to look for your products if you're getting this box is look at page six. So we're going to go page six. I forgot my smile. I'm sorry. More positivity for 2018. <laughs> All right. The first thing is in the box and don't think I'm putting anybody down that gets this box. I just, I think I might have gotten a box that just, like I said, just wasn't for me. The first thing in the box is Ink Readable Glazing Over Intense Color Lip Glaze. I'm not going to swatch this. This has still been untouched. I mean, it's still got its little seal on there, but it is that color. I have decluttered many of these colors, but I do have something somewhere in one of my lipstick drawers that was Incredibles from Sephora. It was, they had a thing going on where it was either a bright pink or a bright orange, and I ended up picking a bright pink, and I still haven't wore it, because I thought, oh, that'd be nice neon color for brimstone, and I never wore it. All right, what does it say about this? They say to be sure to exfoliate your lips before application to see best results on super smooth lips, long lasting intense color gloss with no fuss and no drips. These ultra hydrating glaze shades will bat, 
Well, battle your gloss dilemmas perfect as a gloss on its own or your favorite lip color or over your favorite lip color. There was five different shades available this month which you could receive. And I received the color that I've been decluttering the most out of my lipstick. So I will put this in the giveaway if there's already a lipstick or gloss in that bag, it will be moved to another bag. This way you're not overrun with the same stuff, same type of stuff over and over again. All right, this one I had a little giggle about. It is the Mio, Mio, M-I-O, Fit Skin for Life, Boob Tube. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, I said Boob Tube. This is a multi-action bust cream. It moisturizes, brightens, and protects. Okay, I can understand moisturizing your chest area. I don't know if I want, I need to brighten it. I wear bright enough clothes. I think you could see where they're at. Um, and protect them? I might use this. Give me a little protection from my husband when I'm just not in the mood. <laughs> All right, that is what it looks like. There is uh, one fluid ounce in there. And it says, treat your decolletage. Mm -mm -mm. Treat your boobs. With this rich formula that works to envelope skin in a veil of essential moisture that smooths and brightens the chest, giving you a youthful and radiant skin tone. It's packed with full packed full of amazing natural active ingredients which benefit your skin, slow down the signs of aging. They love it. And apparently you apply this to your neck and then below your breast in an upward motion suitable to use daily. It's suitable for 18 to 80, but no offense, if I start bottom my boobs and I start going up, I don't know about you ladies, but if you have a little bit bigger chest, doing that motion, <laughs> it doesn't feel good. <laughs> we'll figure out how, how and when I will use this, but I will give it a try. Anything, <laughs> <coughs> anything goes, I, I'll give it a try. So I'm interested in that. That's, that's one for one right there. Or well. Yeah. And the next thing is an Erno Last Low product. And if you haven't realized this month, I have fell in love with this company. Now this is the Firm and Lift Essence Lotion. And it says pamper your dry skin after cleansing with a silky smoothing toner. This gentle formula draws in mo moisture, eliminates dullness, and helps with the tissue repair, leaving you with a super soft, hydrated complexion. I'm into toners now, so I will definitely be using this. Like, hands off, ladies. This one's mine. And now we get to turn the page. And we have... We have a brow product. This is a mini... Brow Build Indian Chocolate. Wait, many Brow Build and Indian Chocolate. Oh my gosh, learn to speak. But it's just a little guy. I'm not going to open it up. Um, I did look it up. Indian Chocolate's going to be a couple shades darker. Well, it, it might be a shade darker than it is right now on my eyebrows. But... For me, using brow gel, I like to use it basically alone and then fill, fill in a few little spots. So, I'm going to put this in the giveaway. I have a lot of brow products I need to get through. And I know I'll probably miss out on finding out if this is any good. But somebody out there could end up loving it or hating it and telling me about it. And that would be awesome. <laughs> but that's it. It says anything else. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's it. Mm -hmm. Fuller Brows with this Clever Part Gel Part Cream Brow Mascara. Part gel? Part cream? That sounds like a mess to me, but... I'm not comfortable enough with that kind of product just yet. So, we'll move on. And the next thing we have, it's called Balance Me Natural Skin Care Pure Skin Face Wash. 99% natural. There's 1.35 fluid ounces. And, yeah. There you go. It says, a radiance renewing, revitalizing formula that expertly cleanses skin without stripping moisture. This gentle face wash will purify and refresh your complexion using some divine blends of grapefruit, frankincense, and Roman chamomile oils. It will leave you with a bright and even skin tone. You need to keep this out of your eyes. <laughs> And then there's a little tip down here. It says, start your face wash. Start with your face wash before following with your Erno Laszlo toner to eliminate cleansing rituals. Well, at least they're kind of adding these products from the box and showing you how to use them with the other products. That is actually a good thing, especially if you're first starting out and you're like, what is this? How do I use this? Why is this in here? Well, it's got a little tip down here, so that's pretty neat. I will give that a try. I don't know if I need any more face washes, but it doesn't hurt. So I'll put that in my box. So we're up to... I'm keeping three. Y'all were getting two so far, and then we're down to the last one. Let's see where that goes. We have the Molten Brown London lang lang body wash it's made in england there's 3.3 fluid ounces it says matic gaskin lang lang with uh-uh <laughs> using i have no idea and cedar wood press the pause button and then get ready to unwind I knew there was something I needed to ask. Sorry. Sorry. I need help with the words. <laughs> but it looks like this. Now, it says these deliciously fragrant shower gels are perfect to infuse your bathing and pampering routines. With a little bit of luxury made in England, these scented gels are created of the finest ingredients and fragrances from citrus, floral, and aromatic... Rom See what happens when I try to read fast? For you guys. I can do this with my kid. <laughs> it's got a woody, spicy collection. Perfect for showering, bathing, and relaxing. Okay. Well, let's give it a little snipperoo. Because I can't remember what it was. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Yeah, I smell the cedar wood. It's more of a musky cedar wood smell, which I don't mind sometimes, especially when we go out camping. I, I blend in with the woods. So I will give it a go. And as I'm looking at this stuff, it doesn't have prices. So that means I need to go find prices for you guys. But it even talks about you know, cruelty-free products in the box or in there that they would put into the box. Hey, I just did a mask on that. That's neat. And apparently they're still using other products with that brow gel. I just only like product up here just to kind of fill in the gaps, but if it, I don't know. I'm not for sure with it. And it says next month's box has a birth, it's a birthday edition Eve Lom cleanser. So it gives you a heads up of what's next month. 
Now with everything that was in the box, I did end up keeping four of them in the box. Not knowing the price off the top of my head makes me wonder, is this box worth it? What do you guys think? Um, I'm between, and I need you guys' help, should I keep the Beauty Fix box or my Look Fantastic box? Or do you guys need another month of each one of these boxes to see if it gets any better or any worse? Remember, in some of these subscription boxes, some months will suck. And there is a good chance that I just got one of those sucky months. So let me know what you guys think. And if you get this box, let me know if it will get better. <laughs> All right, I do have a giveaway going on down below. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And I will see everybody later. Bye!